This is a CBS News special report. I'm Anthony Mason with Alex Wagner in New York. The main suspect in this week's truck attack in Berlin, Germany, was killed in a shootout with police in Italy overnight. A manhunt has been searching for Anis Amri since the day after a tractor trailer rammed into a Christmas market, killing 12 people. Omri was killed in the Italian city of Milan, hundreds of miles from Berlin. Charlie Dagada is at the scene of the truck attack in the German capital. Charlie, good morning. Good morning. The Italian interior minister said earlier it is beyond a doubt that the man killed in Milan was the Berlin truck suspect. It's worth pointing out here that the suspect had spent time in Italian prisons. They would have had his fingerprints. He would have been on a database. He was shot dead by Italian police at around 3 a.m. during what's been described as a routine check. Instead of producing an ID, he pulled a pistol out of his backpack, opened fire on the officers, shot one of them. He was then shot dead himself as he tried to run away. Anis Amri had been on the run since the attack here on Monday, where 12 people were killed, another 50 wounded. German authorities had put out an international arrest warrant for him, saying that he was probably armed and dangerous. Now, the news will obviously come as some relief here in Germany that uh, the suspect has been caught and shot dead, but there are also outstanding concerns about the network that may have helped him plan the attack in the first place and may have helped him get away. Alex? Charlie, thanks.